welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching. Today's video is going to be a review and kind of like a first impression on this exciting new palette that I barely picked up today. Yes, I said it today. And when I initially went into Sephora, I went straight for the NARS section and I was like frantically looking for it and unfortunately I didn't see it anywhere. So I asked the sales lady, I said, hey, do you guys have any more of your, your uh, one night stand palette, your blush palette? And she was like, no, we're sold out. And uh, they went so fast, we only had so many. And I was like, what? I was like, I knew it. I, you know, I missed the last one that they launched a couple years back. I missed that one and I for sure wanted to cop this one. So then I kind of just walked around and was like really bummed out. And so finally another sales lady asked me like, is there anything that we can help you with? And I said, yes, actually, you know, I'm kind of bummed that you guys are out of the uh, one night stand NARS palette. And she's like, well, actually we do have one more left and it's actually in, in the front as a visual and um, we can sell it to you. It's sellable. It's not a damaged product. And I asked her if it was used and she said no. And I looked at it and it was in perfect condition. So I bought it and I was so excited because she said it was the last one and she doesn't know if they're going to get it in or what have you. And I was thinking if I went online, they're probably already sold out. So it was actually starting to give up when I actually had the chance to buy it. So I bought it and I'm here today to kind of do a first impression on it and kind of do a mini review. Um, I'll do swatches and things like that. So if you guys have any questions at all, post your comments down below and I'll be sure to answer any of your guys' questions. And so yeah, if you guys want to see this review on the NARS Guy Board Borden, um, one night stand palette, then continue watching. All right guys, so here is the palette. Actually, this is the box. So first of all, I have to say the packaging is two thumbs up. If I could do two thumbs up, I would. The packaging is super cute. It's got a lady that's licking the phone, pretty risque. And it says one night stand on the bottom and then it says NARS Guy Borden on the top. And if I'm saying that wrong, I apologize. I'm not too sure how to pronounce it. And then over here on the other side is just kind of the detailing on the colors. And then it has a overall picture of the palette down here. So we're basically going to open it up and take a look. Like I said, this is a first raw first impression raw I've never ever like played around with it I didn't even swatch it at the store I immediately fell in love with it so there you go the box is empty all right here it is here is the palette before my eyes and basically it has NARS right in here and then Guy Borden right beneath with like this paint swatch the red paint swatch going across and then on the back I was a little disappointed because I thought the colors would be on the back so it's easier for you to tell. I can only understand why they didn't do that because some of these colors are limited so it's not like you can pick it up when you're done with it or if you hit pan. So that's probably one of the reasons why they didn't put the colors on the back. Um, I think there's about two or three colors in here that are in their permanent line and then all the other colors are pretty much um, limited edition. Oh, sorry, I was just looking if the camera is still filming. Um, so basically, you open it up, and there it is in all its glory. It's absolutely gorgeous. I'm super excited about this palette. And um, so there's a huge mirror up top, as you can see, and I don't want to blind you guys, so I'm not showing you. And then there's this little film right here to protect the blushes, um, and it just has NARS on it. And then we are actually going to do a few swatches and really quickly I bought mine from Sephora and right now they are doing their VIB so if you're part of the VIB um, crew then you definitely can get your 20% off of this. Unfortunately I'm not a part of the VIB so I pretty much paid retail price which is $65. It is a little steep but um, 
Honestly, you're getting six products in here, which I think is a really, really good deal. So I'm just going to show you guys all of the mini colors right in here and then basically swatch the colors for you guys if you guys want to see in detail. I will do swatches for you guys. Alright guys, so the first color right up top, this color right here I believe is a limited edition color and the color is called Devotee. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong, right or wrong, so correct me on, down below if you guys know exactly how to pronounce this. Um, so let's do a quick swatch really quickly. This is a really, really pretty um, highlight color. I absolutely love it. I think that it's just very smooth and um, very pretty. And it kind of gives off kind of a really nice sheen, um, clean highlight color. It doesn't have any pink undertone to it. More so, it's just kind of like a golden kind of a crisp white highlight and it's absolutely gorgeous and that one there is called a devotee. Alright, so second color is called Mistinguit. Again, I'm sorry if I'm butchering the names. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce them, but that's the color right here. Um, initially, I thought that color was the Gaietti by NARS, but unfortunately it's not. It's a whole different color. So let's go ahead and swatch this for you guys. So this one right here is more like a very nice soft baby pink shade. Um, it almost kind of looks very, uh, kind of a soft baby pink color. Just a very pink tone. It's really, really pretty. I really, really love it. And that one there is called Mistinguit. Alright guys, so next color is this one right over here. This one is called Ghouli, and um, it's kind of like a, let's do a swatch for you guys. So this one here is kind of like a corally, orangey um, tone. It almost looks like orgasm, but not as quite um, pinky. It almost looks really kind of, like almost like a highlight shade. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it's absolutely beautiful. And I think you can actually kind of use it as a highlight. All right, guys, next color is down here. This one here is a bronzer, and that's the Laguna Bronzer. I actually use that bronzer every day as my bronzing, and it's actually in here, so let's do a swatch really fast. And if you guys haven't used this or tried this, this is actually really, really pretty. It's a very light, kind of a bronzy shade. And um, it's really, really pretty on the skin. It does have a slight shimmer to it, but needless to say, it's a great everyday bronzer. All right, guys, right over here, this is the next color, and that's Orgasm. And I'm pretty sure you guys are familiar with that color because that is a very, very popular color from the NARS collection. And let's do a quick swatch really fast. This color is almost like a pinky, corally tone. It has a little bit of shimmer and it's great for your everyday blush or if you're going out somewhere special and you've got a nice smoky eye. It's really, really, really pretty. And last color is the color right over here. This one is called Deep Throat and this is actually a part of their um, permanent collection. So this one here is Deep Throat. And um, let's do a quick swatch of that. So this one is more like a deeper, kind of a maroon, um, almost like a reddish, brownish, goldy tone, especially if you're wanting to do a really dark fall look. Um, this is a really pretty color. It does have a little a bit of shimmer in it. As a matter of fact, it does have a little bit of shimmer in it, but it's absolutely beautiful if you want a really, really dark um, look to your cheekbones. Alright guys, so that pretty much sums up my raw first impression on the new NARS Guy Borden One Night Stand Blush Palette. Definitely check this out if you can. I would definitely run over to your nearest Sephora um, to pick this up because they are going really fast. Um, like I said in the beginning, I did pick up mine from Sephora 
and it does retail for $65, but they are having their VIB sale, so I definitely take advantage of that. Um, if you guys have any questions at all, don't forget to um, post your questions or comments down below. And um, I will do more swatches on my Instagram. So thank you again for watching. Um, don't forget to stay tuned on Wednesday. I'm doing my first series of my What I Love Wednesdays. So every Wednesday, I'm going to film a video pertaining to what I've been obsessing with for a week, and I'm going to post it every Wednesday and share it with you guys. So this Wednesday is my first episode. Stay tuned for that, and yeah. So I guess I'll see you guys later. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.